Hey, it's Jason Creel. Today is April 16th, 2015, and I wanted to give you an update. Y'all know I'm, if you've been following me, I'm starting a new uh, lawn business in a new area. I, I moved, uh, I think, two days after Christmas, and so, um, you know, hit the ground running in January. So I'm about three and a half months into building my new lawn business, Alabama Lawn Pros. And I'm focused primarily on fertilization weed control and doing just, just very little mowing, um, but a little bit of mowing. So I want to give you an update and just tell you some things that, that's happened where I'm at. Um, as of today, I've gotten about 70 customers, uh, which I'm real pleased with. I, I didn't, you know, starting from literally zero. And then, you, you know, I move up here, I've got family in the area. So we picked up some family members, but you know, you can't make a living off family members. So, um, but anyway, up to 70, I've gotten a lot of, I've, I've just built some real key connections with some uh, guys that do lawn mowing who are referring me business, um, you know, the spraying uh, weed control business. So, so that, that's been real important. Uh, I've done some advertising through Facebook, postcards, done uh, direct mail, um, some some other method, methods I'm using. I'm using Thumbtack. I've gotten a little bit of business from that. So, um, so anyway, I just wanted to give you an update. And uh, you know, and again, 70 customers. If 70 customers in mowing is a lot more money than in in the spraying business, because you know, if you're mowing them every week or every 10 days or every other week, you, you're making a lot more money than spraying where it's not nearly as many times per year so um but you know i think in three months or three and a half months you know i think the big accomplishments things i i can take away at this point is these relationships are key and i think they're key if say you're just doing mowing maybe you need to to really try to invest and get some relationships with guys who do spraying you know because they believe me if you're mowing guys are asking you hey who do you recommend to do the, the spray and if you're spraying guys are asking you who do you recommend to do the mowing so having those relationships um is is key and so i would encourage you to try to build those relationships even you know even with guys that do tree work irrigation work landscape guys who, whoever that you know that you could work out a deal and you're sending them business they're sending you business so um, so that's been that's probably been the biggest key to to growing my business this first year. Um, you know, and it may be year two before I actually make enough have enough customers built up to actually earn a living. You know, but when you're in this for the long haul, you know, I think by year three, that that's when I'm really going to look at starting to grow and hopefully start hiring employees and and uh, seeing where where we can take this thing. So. So uh, I'm real pleased, got my truck, got my sprayer, I've, I've gotten a, a mower, weed eater blower, you know, for a little bit of mowing I've done. So, you know, just securing equipment and all that, it, all this stuff just takes time, getting, getting a business set up, getting your logos, getting stuff put on business cards, postcards, getting um, a logo on the side of my truck and just things like that. It all takes time and I'm not where I want to be. I, I don't have t-shirts yet for for my business, which is something I want to do. I don't even have lawn signs uh, to put in their yard after I uh, treat it, which is something I, I definitely need to do and then shoot myself in the foot as far as advertising because that's a, a key way to advertise your business. So, um, But I've, I've secured some really good contracts, including um, probably one of the nicest neighborhoods in my area. I'm going to be spraying the entranceway there, which, you know, the money's fine on it, but it's just the publicity, um, the exposure of knowing that, hey, my company takes care of the entrance way of the nicest neighborhood in the whole city. So, um, so I was real thankful for that. So anyway, I'm going to try to do some updates maybe once a month or so, just kind of let you know how my business is going. I know some of you follow me and, um, and, and try to throw in what I've been learning, what I've worked for me and uh, maybe some mistakes I've made. So I'm trying to uh, build a spraying business, do some mowing on the side, and I'm, I'm gonna have to make a decision maybe uh, in the next year or two whether I'll continue trying to do both mowing and spraying or maybe focus just on the spraying. So I hadn't had to make that decision yet. So anyway, that's my update, thanks.